All right. Welcome to the first of two videos on the second section of The Giver. And continuing forward with the development of the anti-hero, in this section, he's going to go from accepting and believing in his society and trusting it, which is what you should have been finding evidence of in the first section, to questioning and to pushing back, all right? Now, in this first series of chapters, the ones you're reading next, uh, which is 8 through 10, it sets the stage for his real development. All right, so just as I had mentioned before, you really want to be tracking that key information about his development as the anti-hero, all right? So we saw the nervousness he was experiencing at the end of the last section in the ceremony where he thought he had done something wrong. But now he learns that it's because he hasn't been assigned, he's been selected. And that's a huge difference, right? So as you're moving through chapters 8 and 9, watch for how he starts to feel separate. Take notes on specific quotes that are showing you hints as to what's going on with him. All right, he learns a little more about what was going on with the apple. And uh, he starts to see people treating him a little differently. This really kicks in in Chapter 9. when He talks about feeling separate and different. And when he gets the rules for his new job, all right, he is going to be what's called the receiver. And when he looks through the rules he got, there's one rule in particular that really bothers him. All right, so pay careful attention to pages 68 to 71 and for why that rule bothers him. How does that rule make him look at society a bit differently? Right? What does it break down for him that's key for him being a member of this society? And then finally, in chapter 10, he will meet the giver himself, All right, the old receiver of memory, who is now called the giver, or will be called that. His place looks quite different from the location you've seen. And keep track of the details as he goes into the giver's home, all right? All the items he has. And here's the key question. Why doesn't society have these things? Why does the giver have to keep all of this stuff hidden, right? How would that affect society, right? So that's the first few chapters. The next preview will get into his actual training and is a lot more intensive. All right, it's where uh, we'll really see Jonas start to push back, break rules, and ask a lot of questions. And you're going to want to keep an eye on that. But this early reading tonight is just focusing on setting the stage for that and for you to see how he's starting to feel different. All right, that's the first step in his next stage of his journey as the antihero. So take some good notes on that as you read and be ready to contribute to the discussions in class. Good luck.